Regional train users are set to benefit from Tuesday's state budget with $1 billion earmarked to upgrade every line in Victoria. The plan also includes a new surf coast connection to Torquay, but there is a catch. The state government is relying on money from the Port of Melbourne sale and needs the federal government to get on board. The Premier's train pulled into Warrigal 15 minutes late, which is why Daniel Andrews says his billion dollar upgrades are a necessity. We know that our regional train services need to be better. That's $1.45 billion better, a cornerstone of Tuesday's state budget. $435 million will fund new tracks and stations on the Gippsland line, enabling services to run every 40 minutes. $200 million will boost rail services in Barwon South and Warrnambool. $110 million has been allocated for a new Surf Coast Rail project, including land reservations for a line to Torquay, and $91 million for upgrades in Echuca and Bendigo. It's about giving regional Victorians a public transport system that they can count on. It's also about creating hundreds and hundreds of jobs right across regional Victoria. We're ready to go and we'd be keen to move as quickly as possible to that delivery stage. The state government says this country train package is vital. As just last month there was a record 1.9 million trips on V-Line but to go ahead it needs the backing of the federal government. This would be a great announcement if it was true but unfortunately it's not true. Uh, the money that the Premier is talking about is the subject of dispute between the state and federal governments. But the Premier says he does have the cash thanks to the Port of Melbourne sale. I really hope that we don't have to argue about this. We can just get on and get these upgrades done. Ladies and gentlemen, please note the 9.57 service is completely booked out. We need Proving the upgrades can't come soon enough. Tegan Dolling, 7 News.